G'day viewers, second review of the day, bit of a treat, two new DLC today, one of them the BR187 and this one the 1938 tube stock for Bakerloo, and anywhere else you want to run it in off the rails. I hope this is a little less disappointing than the other one, but we'll see. So I'm just going to back up a little bit out of here, and we're going to have a look. First up, is there training for it? There is. There's a training scenario. Fantastic. We'll have a look at that shortly. That's good news. And how about in the scenarios? So not that one, not that one, not that one, not that one, not that one. Oh, there's one. So we've got a scenario called Blast for the Past, operating a special heritage services from Harrow and Wealdstone to Paddington and then return to the Queen's Park Depot. That sounds all right. Rainy Nights. Well, this one sort of implies that it's got both in there. It's got the uh, Bakerloo stock, the current stock, and the uh, 1938. That would be cool. And Old Dog, same tricks. This is a, another one. Elephant and Castle to Harrow and Wealdstone. Looks like a fairly plain one, so that's uh, probably more of a service, I guess. And then we're back to where we started. So that's good. There are actually some scenarios. In the timetable, what they've done, similar to one of the others, there's now two timetables. So there's the timetable for the normal Bakerloo stock, which for whatever reason doesn't draw, and there's the timetable for the 1938 Heritage stock. Now, there's a few things about this that I saw on this morning's stream that I don't like. I don't like that you can't change the special board. I think that's a bit of a cop-out. They claim that's because it's always a special because it's running on this modern route, but, you know, that's life. Anyway, let's jump in. Let's go... Actually, let's run the training module. Let, let's have a go at that. Let's see what that is. So we'll go back to the scenario. We should have a look at the training. Into our scenario... Oops, wrong. Into our training. And yes, I haven't run Bakerloo since the update, so hence I haven't done any of the training or anything. Okay. So we're going to dive into this thing. Now, to me, visually, this thing is excellent. Really enjoy the way it looks. I've liked it in the pictures. I've liked it on the streams that I've seen it on so far, both the official ones and the unofficial ones that I've watched from other people. So I'm kind of looking forward to this. I have to say, so far from what I've seen, I am a bit disappointed in the sound. But, you know, we'll see what happens. So we're about to launch into the heritage tube stock introduction pity it's a picture of the modern train welcome to this 1938 tube stock in london transport red livery during this brief introduction we'll go through the start and stop procedures climb aboard to get started let's have a look around first looks kind of cool it's certainly short like the other one is let's open the doors and go in yeah. So that's the modern one on the other side there. Oh, let's just jump out the door. What the hell? Bloody run over us. Undercarriage looks pretty nice. Like the way it looks in the sun. Nice reflective coating. It's picking up the other train quite well. I like that. Hmm. I kind of like that so much. I need to do this. Sorry to get distracted. All right, so we've got Bakerloo Line, Wembley Central, and Special. So that sort of suggests that you can change two of them. So I hadn't noticed that, really. We've got some other things on the front. Doesn't look like... Well, they might be turned off because the, it's in tutorial mode. Uh, can we open... Oh, we can open the door. Look at that. All right. Well, let's get back up on our platform. A lot of your time will be spent in the driver's seat. Oh, 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 they're already getting in. Sneaky buggers. Oh yes, it's that problem. You've got to crouch, don't you? Okay, let's shut the door. And it wants us to drop the seat down. Good o. And it wants me to sit in the driver's seat. Insert the master key to enable this well, cab. That's to what drive. I was about to do. And okay, that and mechanic's a little bit better than it used to be. Others around know that this multiple unit is operational. Good o. Head light on. Insert the reverser key. Instrument lights on. What do the wipers sound like? I gotta know. 
Ah, nice. They're quiet. Let's turn off now. Do the wipers rail driver. Um, no, they don't. What about the headlights? No, they don't seem to either, unless it works and we've got to be outside. I can't go outside at the moment because it's turned me off. So I'm going to set the reverse of forward to just this rail driver. Well, no, but that might just be the tutorial. We can hope. Press the button on the guards panel. What about the button on the rail driver? Does that work? What about the keyboard? No, it's really going to actually make me go and do this, isn't it? Oh, hang on. Was I not sitting down? Right, now let's try these things with the rail driver. Ah, it works. Look at that. Okay, forward one. Uh, what about headlights? Ah. So if we go around... That will end up the other end. Go around. So do we have headlights? It's pretty hard to tell in the sun. Hmm. No, I actually can't tell. The wipers come on now. Wiper on. Wiper on. Wiper off. Wiper on. Wiper off. <laughs> Whatever. All right. Now, what about we put... Let's... Uh, can we open the doors? Left door's locked, left door's open. Now, yes, she can. I just heard them unlock and lock. But it, for the tutorial, it's going to make me go down here and push the button, isn't it? That's fine. Move the master controller into the shunting position to start moving forward slowly. I should probably close them again, shouldn't I? I think just maybe close them. Because if I don't close them, we won't go anywhere. All right. Don't mind me, just L plates. Okay, master controller into the shunting position. Whistly thing works. What else works? Oh. When the multiple unit starts moving forward, you can increase the master controller to increase yeah, right. the speed. There's a brake gauge down there that you almost can't see. I don't know what they do. No one seems to know what they do. And there's our real speedo up the top there. Which is, of course... Oh, can you do it? Yeah, you can almost get the controls and the speedo in together. Alright, let's fang this thing. Full bore. It's quick, isn't it? I'm going to reach 30 mile an hour. I actually think that if I take that back there and I put that into position 2, we'll reach 30 mile an hour a whole lot faster. There we go, that's better. Doop. Use the master controller and the EP brake to stop at the station. Ooh, complex. Uh, it's so silent, isn't it? Yeah, the track noise stops when you go off the controller, but I remember if you stand up... What do you know? Track noise. Hmm. Where am the door? Do we get track noise? No, a bit. Let me open this door. No, we can't open this door. We can open the window, though. Plump. Yeah, we need more noise than that. All right, so... Brakes. Brakes, brakes, brakes. Must be this one. Oh, yeah. EP normal. Now, so it's got the electro-pneumatic brakes, which means we electrically apply the air brakes. Can't even see the brake gauge down there. That's a bit crap. Brakes are off. But we also have, beyond the EP Max position, a Westinghouse brake. Kind of like driving with the door open, actually. Suits my sense of humour. How fast are we going? 10 mile an hour. All right, let's come to a stop. Brakes are all right. I don't mind that. Now, let's just have a look outside. I'm going to go down here. All these annoying passengers in the way, and we're going to open the doors with the rail driver. 
Ah, it works. And jostle, 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 jostle. People get stuck in the doors, just like they do on the, the big Bakerloo one. Let's just come up a bit so we get out above them and get jostled so much. Were they polite? All the ones getting on waited for the ones getting off. Wasn't that nice? And now some of the ones that got off have turned around and they're getting back on. That's a compressor. Never heard that during the stream. I know I'm supposed to lock the doors, but people are still getting on. I'm being nice. I don't care if I'm late. Very happy to hear that compressor, but why can't we hear it in the cab? Hmm. All right, let's lock them up. Gee, they lock quick, don't they? Okay. Set the EP brake to max. EP max. Set the reverser to off. Oh, it doesn't mean to get out, does it? Off. I guess we're shutting the train down. Set the reverser key to out. And headlights off. Master key lever to off. Yeah, it's kicking me out of the train. Uh, this mechanic's still a bit bodge. In fact, the master key's gone, isn't it? Look at that. Let's just turn off the marker so we can see better. Can't. Okay. Mechanic's still awful on this. They haven't fixed it since the Isle of Wight. Okay. Set the handbrake lever to 30%. Let me zoom out a little. I'll just do that from here because I'm lazy, you know. Now we got to wind the thing. So you can pull it on properly. Because humans aren't strong enough. Good work. That's the basics covered. A manual can also be obtained that provides more details what? about the full functionality of this multiple unit. There's a manual? It's never a manual. Alright, let's go and drive the thing for real. Alright, not going to run a scenario. I want to jump into the timetables. And let's see what this thing looks like. The reason I'm running a scenario is because I'm going to fist fight around and stop and start things. Now, uh... Uh, let's just let's give it some wind or well, maybe some clouds hang on let's go for the light clouds we're in october we're in may last time i came in here this time it's october what's going on all right so i'm trying to remember what was outside elephant and castle was outside wasn't it and the, up at the other end was inside so that's london end that's the other end i think Or is that the other end? So that's the London end. Alright, that's the other end. We want to look at it outside. There's not much point looking at it in a hole. So let's see how we go. Let's mess around with it and see what it looks like and how it behaves. So far I'm happy. Sound is quiet in the cab. That needs to be addressed. But happy it works with rail driver. Did I just launch a timetable in the dark when I want to look at the train? What a wally. Or is it light outside, maybe? Hmm. Oh, well, let's go look at it in this light. Nice reflections. I, I really like the gloss finish on the outside. I reckon that's cool. That's nice. That is old school painted varnish. And yes, I did pick a dark time. So we're going to start another one, obviously, because we want to see what this looks like in the light. But it looks cool. Oh, actually, let's just jump this, drive this one briefly. Let's get in the front door. Can we get in here? Is there a step? Master controller shunting. What? But I'm not in the train. Hmm. I think I'm in the train. Maybe I am. Huh, I am. Okay. All right. That was me. Now, cab light. Cab light on. No, it probably won't work till we put the master key in. 
that's the key in and joggle it around here find the thing there we go it's on now can i have cap lights no, i still can't have cap lights let's put the reverser in let's put it in forward to it's not moving is it all right Oh, I'm going to go out in the light. I want to see what I'm doing. Ah, sigh. I want to see what I'm doing because I want to know if it's me or if it's the train. All right, let's go to light clouds again. Not light rain, light clouds. Go away. Oh, someone liked my video. That should make me happy. I shouldn't say go away, should I? You say, happy, thank you. That was nice. Okay, let's go up here to... We still want to be up this end somewhere, not that end. Not that end, not there. There, there we go. Harold and Wildstone to Elephant and Castle. So... I'm trying to remember. So that's where it's going, isn't it? The orange one. I can't remember. I never look at this bloody map. So we actually want to be... We had this figured out. We had this figured out on these six o'clock ones. So we had the London Road Depot. That's the other end. Harold and Wildstone Elephant Castle. And we went we started at Queen's Park. So let's go and find a Queen's Park one that starts during the daylight. And my son's completely forgotten again that I'm recording something because he's a nut. Alright. So let's start there. Hopefully I picked a good one this time. Because you know it's going to happen if I didn't. Okay. We are in daylight this time. Yes. Okay. Let's put our switch in. And just jiggle it around till we find just the right spot. There we go. Okay. We'll put the headlights on. Instrument lights on. Don't need anything else up there, do we? Cold start. Do we need that? Probably. Can we put lights on now? Oh, can, yes. Okay, so let's put the reverser in. So it was just me before. Alright. We probably want to reverse the one, actually, so we don't want to go that fast. Now, brake release. Uh, can we see the gauge down there? Is it doing anything useful? Now, interestingly, can we hear... No compressor, but we are starting to roll. All right, let's start shunting then. So use the master control. It's working properly with the rail driver. We can turn our light off now, I guess. Oh, it fades away. I like that. I'm going to do that again. Cab light on. Oh, you've got to push it hard. Okay. Cab load off. And it fades out. That's kind of cool. Let's see if this thing stops from the outside. And I might just go around the front, I think. What am I doing up here? Wow, I've lost control. Lost control. Well, we've seen it from underneath now. Look at that. That's cool. Hmm. Better put some brakes on, eh? Whoops, wasting our time. DP Max, that's all we want. Single busted danger. Well, it looked cool for a little while. Alright. Let's get serious this time. Let's stop mucking around. I'm meant to be doing a review of this thing, not mucking around. But mucking around's fun, though. <sighs> okay. Let's muck around less. That's what we want to do. Lever on. So they've got the on mechanic. I think they've done that pretty well. Instrument lights, which turns on the funny blue thing. Uh, brakes off. Key in. Into forward. And brakes roll off. Tooty tooty. Off we go. 
We're not supposed to go fast in here, are we? Now, let's try that again. Looks nice. Nicely, nicely weathered. Headlights are on. So it was just a tutorial. It wouldn't let me do that before. That's pretty cool. So we'll try and change that sign when we get in there again. And we've got the near field thing that makes you go faster or slower or whatever. What are the odds of getting this right, huh? At least we're in the world this time. We're not underneath the world. So it's quite a long train. Uh, we're almost there. Oops. So I think we might want to... Alright, that'll be good enough. Let's get the doors open and then let's get up. And let's go for a walk. Let's just clunk that thing off. You can't clunk it. Alright. Because I hear a compressor running. Let's go outside. I like the compressor. I want to be able to hear that in the cab. Yeah, collectibles. Check. All right, let's look at the ads. So it's an ad for Rivet Games, youtube.com slash Rivet Games. Does that work? Isn't it slash C slash Rivet Games? Anyway, that's fine. Members and volunteers wanted, so they're advertising the London Transport Group, which are the people that own this train. And some ice cream and a naked lady in a bath. I'm not quite sure how they go together, but you know. Old advertising. And the next train's gone, so... Okay, so this is talking about when these trains were going away in 1985, so a little history lesson. That's kind of cool. And you can travel on the special train, so I guess that's what we're doing. And it's got the map of the line there, which is kind of cool. And our naked chick in the bath. Oh, she's over here too. Guess we'll be seeing a lot of her on streams. I just walked into a wall. Pretty clever. There's a different ad down there. I'm really struggling with the walking today. And there's um choo choo. Chewy um, I guess. <coughs> Excuse me. So in here it's pretty cool. Apparently that shouldn't be there. Should be another couple more chairs. But, you know, that's cool. Now I'm guessing this is an emergency brake valve. But, you know, we're not allowed. Now what about the guards thingy? No, I don't want to give up control. I'm just messing around. So let's close the doors then, since it's so insistent. None of these buttons do anything by the looks of it. Press to speak. Speak close. Can't press any of those. What about over here? Can we press any of these? No, so we've only got we've got our door buttons. We can't press anything else. Can't press ooh, hang on. Passenger lights on. Alright, we can do that. Let's go into this car. What does that look like? Might have to come back there later when it's moving. So this carriage is basically the same. Just hasn't got the controls in it. Can we open that? No. Can we do that? No. Alright. That's enough of that. Let's just have a look at this door out here. I suppose I should close that. It's not going to go anywhere. And there's that compressor again. I really like that compressor sound. I just wish you could hear it in the cab. Now, I want to have a look underneath. Don't get to see much underneath on these things, but... That's yeah, pretty nice. Nice and dirty. Ow, 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 750 volts, ow, third rail, ow, 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 frying my testicles, ow. Yeah, it looks like it's a little bit wet. That's kind of cool. Oh, it's the evil twins. They're back. They're watching. Got a bit of side eye from the front one. Uh, no, he's watching. Better duck down. Duck, duck. Damn, I was ducking. All right. Should probably move again, eh? All right. 
let's get in the front if we can. Can we? E, climb steps. Yes, you can. If you look down at them. No, I don't want to give it up. I'm still here. That floor is nice. Drive shut. Okay, what do we got over here? Got our weak field flag. Let's put that down. See what difference that makes. I wonder what this thing was in the other one too, and I couldn't quite figure it out. They don't really show you. I guess maybe a heater or something. All right, should we shut the door? No, let's leave it open. Be friendly. All right, brakes off. Now, does it go different with the weak field flag? It's still too quiet. It needs more noise. Ah, oh, we're going to go down the hole, aren't we? I wanted to go the other way. It'd help if I knew the line, wouldn't it? Do you know I've never been in there? Never driven a train in or out of there. Down we go, down the hole, full speed. So it's accelerating pretty well, but it might be because we're going down a hole. Hmm. Now you can always read the brake gauge now. It's so quiet. I've opened the window, does it get louder? A tiny bit. I've opened that window. Can I get on the window? The light on. That'll help me get on the window. I'm meant to stop, aren't I? Now we're going straight through. Let's try the Westinghouse brakes. Westinghouse charge. No, we're in emergency. We're stopping good. Oh, we are stopping. Got up to 50 mile an hour. That's pretty cool. Should we try going back? Hmm, that's the question. Or do we just keep going? Let's go. Well, a little bit of cut out in the sounds there. I hope this door is a better. Oh, that's better. Here's the next station. EP Max is what we want. No, not normal. Max. Stops pretty quick. That'll do. Oh, let's get up, go have a look. Hello, I'm short. I'm not. Alright, let's go have a look now that we're in here. Oh yeah, we were going to try and change those boards, weren't we? Okay, open the cabinet. And what do we do? We click on it. Destination blind. Blank. Bakerloo. And we can't, we can only change the one. Let's go look. Bakerloo, Bakerloo. Okay. That's not helpful. Not in service. No, oh, yeah. not in service. Elephant Castle, Queen's Park, Wembley, Wilson Junction, Lambeth North, Paddington. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Now, can we activate any of these controls that we have down here? New, new. Did I need to set the tail lights up the other end? Probably. I mean, Bakerloo, you can't get up in your station. Let's go look at the tail lights at the other end now. Let's uncrouch, shall we? I think I just ran into that girl's boob. It's remarkably pointy. All right, we're gonna have to walk through the train, aren't we? Yeah, it looks. Yeah, it's natural, nice, warm lighting. Look at that. Compared to the lighting from the station with the modern lighting, you yuck. Natural warm lighting, nice. Modern lighting, yuck. No, I don't want to give it up. I'm just annoying you, game. 
Ooh, dark. Okay. How do we do tail lights? Door cut out. Trip power. Cold start. Coupling. There's nothing for tail lights here. Maybe they're already on. Let's have a look. Oh, they are. Look. Look, they're red. I have to say, that's worth one of these. Can I upload it? Not gonna upload it, are you? Go on, upload it. Just in case, do one of these too. It's that one that uploads it. Okay, I'm just a dummy. All right then. Should we shut the door? I suppose so. Some tramp might get in. Are there any other controls we can mess with in here? Doesn't really look like it. Still curious what this thing is. They said it was some kind of speedo, but I don't understand that. Maybe it would maybe that blanking plate had a speedo on it. And maybe that funny light is to light up the speedo. That would kinda make some sense, wouldn't it? So when they put this new thing in, why didn't they just put it there? God, wallies. Hmm. No, I like it. So far. So far. So far, so good. Let's turn off our little lighty tighty. Let's get rid of that. Eee. It's kind of nice. Red patterning. Alright. Let's run through the train. Back in the station. Run through the station. Annoyed people. Annoyed people. Annoyed people. Let's not try not to run in anyone's boob this time. No, I don't want to give it up. You always want me to give up my train. I don't want to give up my train. I want to drive my train. It may not seem like that, but I do. Alright. Can I... My cursor on the seat. I can. Let's go. Brakes off. Oops. Closed doors. Doors are closed. Okay. Let's go. Still wants to stop at that station behind us, but I don't want to. See, electromatics don't change anything really. So on EP Max, and I can out push it with the motors. Westinghouse hold. Westinghouse charge. does work. I think the brakes are wrong though because there's hold and there's charge and there's emergency. So, you know, where's apply? So charge would be release. It's not liking me go this fast in a tunnel, is it? Alright. I think what I want to do since I messed that one up. See, what service are we actually in? That doesn't help me. We're in... This doesn't help me either, does it? Hmm. Let's look at the map. Can't scroll this map. What I want to do is I want to go back out and I want to find a service that's outside and this time not stuff it up. Because I don't want to go down the hole. I want to drive it outside. I want to see what it looks like outside. So let us back into the services, back into this one. Let's have some light clouds again. Let's do that one. Looks like it does the livery editor thing, but I don't do the livery editor thing, so that's fine. So that's that end to that end. But I want to be outside. And I want to be during the day. that starts I never can remember does it start at the orange one and go to the white one or does it start in the white one and go to the orange one I kind of think elephant castles down the hole but yeah let's try it let's try it it'll either be down the hole or it won't we'll know in a minute because I do want to see this thing outside because I want to see what it looks like properly 
Ah, oh, it's down the bloody hole. So want to go the other way. Let's go the other way. I don't want to be down the hole. Yes, yeah, so I want to quit to the main menu. And I want to shoot my children who are walking around everywhere. Okay. Light clouds. Let's see if we get this right this time. So is Queen's Park at the other end? So, I would, yeah, so that's... Okay, so we want to be at the orange one, because the orange one's where we start. Harold and Will's Stowed Elephant Castle. Let's try that. Let's try that. Does that work? There's the dreaded 187. Someone's already got a screenshot in. Pity it's crap. Not the screenshot. The train. Ah, we're here. All right. We're going to be on some nice morning light, too. So let's get out. Oh, open the door. Open the door. Open the door. Just get out here, then. Yeah. Because I want a proper look. It's kind of cool. I am surprised in 1938 that these carriages would have been non-smoking, but apparently these are built more for rail tours than anything. Are they uncouplable? Not from here. Okay. Looks pretty nice. It's pretty long. Alright. Let's go and jump in. Let's go all the way back down here. The dappled light on the thing's nice. I really like the way it's side the side coating's working. I like that. They've done well. So visually, really good. I'm sad about the sounds, but I think that could be fixed relatively easily. Alright, so master key, jiggle, and reverse a key. Let's put that to forward two. Can rail driver headlight gonna work? Yep, I think. Headlight on pressed. We've got a headlight? Should have. Yes! Okay. And there's three. Someone was whining about that, but I don't care. I think that's cool. Alright, brakes off. Oh, we don't have instrument lights. We have instrument lights. We have a brake gauge we can't read. And we're rolling. Okay, let's move. Now, let's get out. You dummies are all over there. That mine doesn't go anywhere. You should be over here. Doors open. Let's go talk to these people. Oi, I know it's pretty. I know you like looking at it, but you know, no trains go that way. They only go this way. All right. Why am I down here so low? Go up, up, up. So I want to go in. I want to be here so we can listen to it drive away. All right, locking the doors. All right, we're going to go flat knack just to see what it sounds like. Let's just make sure that signal went green. It did. Okay, flat knack time.
45 mile an hour. together aren't they? Is that realistic? Doing 50 mile an hour at the moment. Better put a little bit of brake on I suppose. shoot a bit but you know whatever any time now Ooh, we're stuck I reckon we've just crashed the desktop hmm well that's embarrassing um, how do I copy this stuff click here to view the directory okay well they're over there good oh well was that the train? Was that the game? There's a question for you. Don't really know. Have had a few issues with the game crashing since the big update. Well, actually, since the rush hour stuff came in, the update 426 was fine. Uh, well, anyway, I think I will call that the end of the video. Because I'm going to play some more, but you probably don't want to watch me anymore. Um... Overall, yep, happy with the purchase. Sounds a weak, not awful, but weak. Um, Playability is fine, controller is fine, um, all those things work. I think I like driving this thing around. I think it's worth the twenty-eight ninety-five or whatever it was I paid for it, Australian. So, um, I actually, interestingly, I did notice that Epic costs more. Epic's like a dollar more. What's going on there? And Xbox, oh, you guys are on a winner. Twenty-one dollars, winner. You'll get it cheaper. Hmm. Anyway, I think that's enough for this video. So am I happy I bought it? Yes. Will I give it a thumbs up on Steam? Yes, but I'll make some comments about the sounds. So I will probably chuck this one in the stream on Sunday because it was going to be just Dresden um, with the Meisen branch. But, you know, there's not a hell of a lot on the Meisen branch. I reckon I did Meisen branch in the 1938 stock because I think that would be fun. All right then, thank you very much for watching. I hope this has been useful and enjoyable for you and see you on the streams. I welcome any and all feedback. Feel free to comment on the video. Constructive criticism is welcome, especially if I've got something wrong. I stream every Sunday morning starting at 8.30 a.m. and I also do ad hoc streams from time to time during the week. Please subscribe and click notify to avoid missing out. Subscribing helps me by helping me see what content is good and how it helps the channel grow, or doesn't as the case may be.